Hey guys, so today I'm going to get ready. I am going to be on a panel and I think it's going to be via Zoom. Well, I know it's going to be via Zoom. They sent me the link. So let's get ready for that. I'm going to start off with some skincare. This is a new product that I got. This is the Baby Cheeks Versed Skincare. It's all in one hydrating milk. How dry skin, you guys? For the glow, I'm going to use this Innisfree Dewy Glow Jelly Cream. Now I'm going to do my brows. Right? For eyeshadow today, I'm gonna use my ColourPop It's a Mood palette. I love this palette. I'm just gonna do a little bit of this violet here. I wanna do something very angular and just cute. Kind of shape an angular look. And then I'm just going to go in the corner and I'm going to apply this in the corners. Okay guys, so just to diffuse everything, I'm just going to go in with my Studio Fix and I am going to diffuse this so it looks nice and blended. I'm going to do the... I don't think that one side really needs it. And then the insides, just a tad bit. This pink color and just like dab that all in the center. Like so. And then just keep dabbing it and like blend it out. Okay, guys, so for primer today, I'm going to use my blurring primer. I love this blurring primer. Laura Mercier, it's my favorite. It literally just zaps your skin and makes everything look so pretty. It's going to make my foundation look snatched. I don't wear it all the time. Only when I want my skin to look like a baby's bottom. See, it already looks like I have makeup on, right? Like I have foundation on, but I don't. I'm gonna go in with my corrector. Tinted corrector, always. 
Okay, I'm just gonna blend the corrector out. I'm gonna go in with my Urban Decay Stay Naked Foundation. This is my current go-to foundation. And I'm almost done with it. My other one is my NARS Long Longwear Radiant. I finished that a while ago. As you guys know, I'm really trying to finish my foundations as they come in. If I really like it, I keep it and I finish it. And I really like this one, but I don't have any more. I think this is like end of the bottle. This is done. Okay. Gonna have a little bit left. This has a little bit left on it. I can still get some goods out of it. Oh my God, it's done. For concealer, I'm going in with my Stay Naked Concealer. You guys know I love this concealer. It's my favorite. I'm just going to clean up those edges a little bit. Same thing over here. I'm just gonna put on and clean up the edges just a little bit. And then I'm just gonna go in with my beauty blender and I'm going to blend this out. The panel is about beauty, so I wanted to have a very like beauty aesthetic look to do a little contouring gonna just contour over here and contouring just adds a warm a glow to your face set my under eye you guys know I always do this with my Laura Mercier and while I do that you know I always take the excess and just kind of set everything else do that over here while I do that I just kind of Go everything else so under I'm not gonna be doing like something really bold just like a barely there moment just a little bit of color like almost like I didn't put any color you don't want it to be like super bare but you also don't want it super dark so what you're gonna do is you're just gonna take that and you're gonna drag it some people like to keep it bare but I just feel like if you keep it bare, it's just a little too harsh. So just a little blend is good enough, but then you don't want to put on too much because then it's going to look a little too harsh. <laughs> so without is too harsh and with too much is too harsh. You need that happy medium. For my inner corners of this look, I'm going to go in with this highlighter because I really want my inner corners to pop. So you have to go in with the highlighter. I'm going to go in with something super pink and super intergalactic and then I'm going to take this highlighter I'm also going to go on top so it can have like a really cool gleam with this look today I'm going to use these naked drama lashes they're super fluffy but I'm excited I think I'm going to have to cut them just going to let that kind of bend I like these, you guys. They're really fluffy and pretty. I want a dramatic lash, but not so dramatic that you can't see the makeup. Not too hard to apply. It's not bad. That's nice. Those are nice, you guys. And I have pretty small hooded eyes, but these still look really nice. I think this whole pack was like $15, which is awesome. It's called Tafeta. But these are actually cute. They remind me of Lily Lashes, like no lie. It's okay. And then you just, because these are kind of heavy, you want to push them up. And what I like is I can actually use mascara with these because they're just, they kind of look like mink, but they're not mink. I try not to wear mink lashes anymore, you guys. I heard it's really bad. Like they pluck the animals, something about that. And I don't think that's cool. But I know a lot of them are like faux mink, but it has to say faux mink on it or else I won't fuck with it. Okay, so I'm just gonna go in with Peach's blush and I am going to use this to brighten up this face because it was looking much better. There you go, color. So I'm gonna use a little bit of highlighter and I'm gonna just use this little brush to do it. I don't want a lot of highlighter, I just want a little bit. 
just right there just to give myself a glow when I speak nothing intense gonna do one over here a little on my nose and a little right there Gonna do this glow mist. I think I need a little bit more glow. My face is looking a little dry today. I'm using this lip liner. But I got her El Cosmetics. I like love it because it's like a true brown, like a dark, actual dark brown. I'm gonna have it blend in a little bit. And with Mac, kind of sexy. And I'm gonna add that in there. And I'm gonna go over it again, just so you can see some definition. And then I'm really into this whole glimmer look. I'm gonna use this gloss. This is the Selena gloss in the washing machine. And it's so pretty. I'm just gonna put that in the center. Right there. And I'm gonna press it in. So this is the finished look of the day. I love it. It's very, I think it's like a halo eye. Let me know what you guys think. Bye.